hello everyone you are welcome to my youtube channel i am Rudon ibrahim in this video i'll be showing you how you can transfer your design from printer structure to printer details so that you can view the detailed drawing of the structure okay so it's going to be a short video and then very straightforward this is um printer structure 2021 you are going to follow the same principle if you are using printer structure 2022 so this is the drawing is just um two floors one story and now how are you going to do that um just come to um drawing and reports okay come to drawing and reports then you are going to see brutal details you are going to see brutal details if you are using brutal structure 2018 or brutal structure 2019 you will see a tab at the top here where you see something like concrete design concrete design from there you see where you can transfer it to brutal details so now just click on brutal details All right, now printer details have opened and you can see the project. The project name is CAD RC. So now, how do you want to proceed? You have two options. You can either auto generate the details or you start by creating new drawing. Okay. When you auto generate, that means you want to generate everything at the same time. That is, you want to generate the beam, you want to generate the column, the slab, the foundation, the stair, and everything. No, stair is not there actually. So you want to generate all those apart from the stair. But when you click on start by creating a new drawing, you are going to be the one to create them one after the other. So you can go with any of the two. Okay. So now I will go with um, start by creating a new drawing. What you are going to do is um, let's try to create a drawing for our beam. Uh, no, let's say column first. So when you have column application plans, this column application plans, it is basically the um, the cross section of your column. Okay. The form plan here, you can draw um your slab your foundation and then you know your this is the slab in story one this is the slab in story two and this is the you know your foundation level okay so um let me create um a column it is still the same process actually so let me create the form plan sorry the column application plan for story one so click on draw you right click right click then you click on draw then it's going to show this whatever you want to see maybe you want it to insert the quantity table and then the model info let me uncheck this or let me check everything okay now if you want the link to be hidden okay so you have to hide the link okay but if you definitely want to show the link click on show link okay so and then if you want this to be shown next to the plan you click on this okay so this is uh the different options you have so anything you want to do here make sure you change that so click on draw and then just drop it anywhere you know you left click okay so now you are going to see your column applications you can see here you have column this is column one in story one which is one c one and you can see the dimension all right so that is how you are going to go about creating a section for your column what about if you want to create the elevation it is still the same process you can see you have the elevation here so for the story one let me just try to create one let's see this so you right click now you have three options you can either draw the column elevation single story that is column one c1 you know it's just in a particular story you can click this that's what you have now if you want to draw column elevation true stories you know when you have a column the column might be running from the foundation up to the last floor okay so if you want to draw it like that you are going to create this second one you know the first one which means single story it is just going to create that column in that story but here is going to show the combinations of the column you know the one at the top the one at the bottom how the lap and everything like that okay now if you want to draw column schedule this is what you're going to do okay so now let me use the second one which is draw true stories and then just click on that now um it is going to select the two stories because the column is running from story one to two so i will say yes and then you click on okay so if you have many stories let's say you have six stories and you just want to consider maybe three out of the six stories maybe you want to consider story one story two story three this is how you are going to go about it you just deselect the one you do not want and then you select the ones you want to see so click on ok and now i'm going to drop it anywhere like here okay so now you are going to see the column you can see everything here you can see you have minus so the story um the the, the foundation is 1.1 meter and then you can see this is the beginning where you have the normal floor and you can see your starter bar lapping your um your bar in this story so you can see how it is being lapped and then you can see at this story you have your beam 
you can see this is another story so this is um, the section of your beam all right then you have the the last level here which is six meter okay and then you can see the dimension of the of the column you can see how they are arranged okay even the form plan is being attached to it at the side okay so it is um as simple as that you go to if you want to see the beam it is still the same process okay so you can see your story beams elevation so if you want to see your beams you are going to do the same thing so i'll just create one beam we don't want to create everything so this is just one beam you can see one b one two one b three so right click click on draw now let's drop it somewhere uh we'll drop it here okay so you can see you have your beam and then you can see everything is being dimensioned like this all right so this is one way on how you can create your details drawing using total details we have two ways one is auto generate and another one is create new drawing this particular one is create new drawing if you enjoyed the video make sure you give it a like and if you are not a subscriber yet kindly give my channel a subscription thanks for watching